quite, it's quite cold, you know. <laughs> it's quite cold. We have come to Maastricht and we are looking for the city center. I've never been in the centrum. You haven't? No. It's quite I've far. I've never been here. I've been, uh, I think, twice or two times. In the centrum? Yeah, in the centrum. Yeah, you go out with your friends. I don't... But it was also Ooh. at school. Oh, you go here at school? Yeah, too. Twice. Oh. That's how I think you find out about it. Guys, it's really cold here. See, everywhere it's snowing. In Venlo, the snow has uh, dissolved. Yeah, but it's like it's colder here. Yeah, it's so. <laughs> so you know the way a little bit here. No. Do you know this area? You said you've been no, here before. No, not this area. I went like from these, uh, from the maps area. That's ah. how we went to the city. Okay. Because I really love this trick and, uh, and uh, yeah, I also want to live in my street. Is it always in Nijmegen? I don't know. One of the two. I keep getting those uh, cities confused. Uh, I don't think it's much different anyway, except for the language. The language is Dutch, but they talk here like they are singing. But like in Maastricht, or is it, I don't know, on either one of the two, they're building a new guy, a new city, a new part of the city, and like it's completely new, it's smart, futuristic, uh -huh. and I really like to like live there, you know. Mm -hmm. For me, that would be the ideal place to live, because it's a big city, and I really like. Um, from what I've seen, I almost live there. Oh. <laughs> from what I know, I really like uh, big cities, because uh. I love in individually there you get to be there. individual yeah you get to be in a big city no yeah in the villages everything is so everybody knows each other right. and too much gossiping right what i heard from people in big cities is the same thing only in a much larger scale yeah, yeah. But like i'm not planning to be known there i'm just planning to do my own thing mm -hmm. you either vibrate it or you don't yeah that's my thing about how I feel about it. It's cold. Yeah. I'm sorry, I curse too much. Even my children are complaining. I, I use too much bad words. Uh, I notice all the bad words, they leave my mouth. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> the bad words too easy. <laughs> huh? They yeah. are leaving your mouth. They leave my mouth too easy, like for students. Maastricht is really a, a, stu a student city. Just like Groningen, you come from Groningen. What do you think of Groningen? A real student city, what you said. Um, I don't know, I got so used to living where I live now that I'm like, I don't feel connected to Groningen anymore. Oh. But you used to want to go back to Groningen always. Yeah. <laughs> People are slippery. Very slippery. And like, one of the reasons like, I love women is that in this weather they wear wheels, excuse me, heels, and they sleep. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like, that's like so real. I love that. It's like very stupid thing to do, but I know. Uh, can you do we remember where the car is? Because we're walking. <laughs> do we remember? Oh, I don't think we're Huh? If you make uh, some pictures here. Which of the park haters fake store? Yeah, 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 yeah. You're smart. But still, make some pictures. Park here, please. Walking. Yeah. I'll make some pictures. Okay. Yeah, here. Okay, we'll find it. Make a screenshot here, so I don't need to paint. Because it will really be something for me to yeah. just walk away and know, remember where my car is. Oh yeah, but don't you have like a system you can track your car? I don't know. Oh, maybe you should think about that. That would be like good thing for you. I should, I should have. Because on iPhone we have like uh, the Apple key. 
Costco. Yeah. And then you can just put that on your things and locate it wherever it is. Mm. I think the car has it, but maybe you have to activate it. Yeah, I also know a Range Rover has it also installed. Like they have it installed in the car system. So maybe your car has it too. That would be cool. I always like the way people look at you when you walk with camera. Oh, I didn't even notice. I do. I'm the one with the camera too. When I was in Kenya, people like run away for the camera. They're like, no, I don't want to be in the camera. Me too. I, I was in the filming. market and uh, I was filming the fruits and everything. And one guy just got upset. He said, no, don't put my, my, my face everywhere. You want to put my face everywhere on the internet? I don't want to be in the camera. You should take me out. I was like, this, this world is not revolving on you guys. Why? I'm just, oh, there's an after shop there. Let's go Some watch. people are like really paranoia, it's kind of scary. Is this my car? Almost no. The I don't like the the black side. It's so ugly. This is a boy out there. Let's oh, this is also a nice car. I like the Audi too. The Audi. This this is Audi's my car. Yeah. Think Audi is not that spectacular this kind of car because we see it a lot. The first shop we enter is the Apuka shop. I also know that it's a black owned African shop. Yes. Because a lot of times African shops are promoting the African shop, but they're not actually owned by Africans. Yes. And I don't like to shop at those shops. Especially in uh, Amsterdam. In Amsterdam, yeah. you see a lot of African shops mm -hmm. and uh, they sell African uh, products, but their half is like Arab. And um, how is these yeah. people? Um, Indians, yeah. Indians, Arabs. Mm -hmm. And they compete on the market. Dutch. With, yeah. And they compete on the market with actual Af Africans. And because they're like in Amsterdam, they have a way, way, way more bigger customers than this kind of businesses. So like, I like shopping at this people and I like support them and I also like bring, spending more money here than there because this is like your blood, you know? Mm -hmm. So yeah, hello, hello sir. Yeah. <laughs> Are you scared? <laughs> Can I help you? Hey, yeah. What do you want to buy? Yeah, I was just looking at this screen. Because, uh, oh, yeah, this one. I definitely want to buy this one. What is that? This is a version of yeah. hair fertilizer. It works really well on your hair. What is it good for? Like, it opens your hair fossils and then makes it good. So I'll buy that and then it the makes it less curly or what? No, it, it opens your hair fossils yeah. and it lets more hair grow there. Oh, things like for that. hair growth? Yeah, for hair growth. So definitely good. So I definitely want to buy one of those. Hair fertilizer, never heard of that. Yeah, it's really great. It's really good. And since it's like Nigerian made, it's also made for like people with my hair guys, so I can use it like, it's very nice to use. Mm -hmm. yes, that is one, yes. What is that? Yes. Soap. It's, a, it's so good. It is so good. Because I have like spots in my face, if you can see here. And it helps with this soap, like it's gonna help against it. Mm. That's like I'm looking for. It's like it lightens to those kind of places. So mm. That's why I'm looking for it. And at the African shop, you have the best light for my skin. So you can go inside and buy it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, even me, I'm learning new things here. I don't know all this. Inside, right? <laughs> so are you done? Yeah, I will more. Because, you know, I always take a time with shopping. Yeah, I always take Me, I'm time. like, uh, pop, 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 clock, I'm go. Yeah, I, mean, I, mean, yeah, I enjoy shopping, so I always want to take my time. So I don't believe I'm <laughs> Are you shy? He's not used to cameras. I was like that too. But you, you seem like a natural, Victoria. You don't seem like a. Yeah, that's because like I always interview myself in front of my like <laughs> on my phone, for my friends. I interview myself to them. I show it to them. So like it's always natural. Like I'm just imagining you as my all my friends. Uh -huh. okay, hello friends, come see this. <laughs> Actually, I 
village. I I need one. I need to finish. You need to get the green pot. The green one is best. Uh, yeah, I like How the green. The, uh, they like most the red one. Yeah, but this one is... No, we're talking about the eco gel. Ah, the eco gel. The green is there. Wait. No, you don't have the green one. Mm, yes, it's there. Where is it? It's there. Oh. Yeah, yeah, that one is okay. I also have this one. I don't know what this one is. Like. I'm, I'm gonna buy this some more time because I still have some. Mm -hmm. Well, I think that does it for me. Oh, but Uncle, mm -hmm. uh, the, do you have like one with the thing on? Because I need to know the end because my skin is very Wait, sensitive. Wait, you check there? Yeah. I'll check her once again. Because like my skin can't handle some things and like if I don't know the ingredients then it could harm my skin. Because mm. I have sensitive skin. Especially now in the winter. So this is it? Yeah. What is this? Oh, cocoa butter. Yeah. Oh, this one I used to, it's very nice. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Well, everything is in French. No. Oh. Oh, I can read it. Oh. Pure papaya extract, sodium. Oh, but, okay? yeah, but then look at this. <laughs> this is, you know, but like I heard that if you like cut it in pieces and then only just use it on your dark spots, it will fade away over time. It will make you this light? Yeah, but... Wow. That's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. So guys, I'm not promoting skin bleaches. I want to say this is right. But I'm not promoting skin bleaches, bleaching, excuse me. But I am promoting, like, I have the spots there and I want them to go. So like, only on this dot, I'll rub this cream so it goes away. Because it takes too long naturally and I don't have time for that. Because like, I want to be a supermodel. I have to be a supermodel hour, always. <laughs> you get what I'm saying? <laughs> you guys get it? <laughs> That's what I'm saying. So I'm not promoting skin bleaching. Love yourself for who you are, but fix your imperfections. Yeah. So we're not going to buy these things. We're not going to buy this. You want to buy this? Yeah, I want to buy this. You have a bag? No, we don't have a bag. Okay. Okay, in the Netherlands, we pay for a plastic bag to um, turn against climate issues. So we pay like, for the initial shop, we pay 50 cents. And some other shop, you pay on euro or money less. It depends on where you are. So we have to pay for the 50 cents. So you know that. In the Netherlands, that we do that here. I don't know, because in a lot of countries, they don't. They don't. I even, like, I even had, I was like, I even had that some that Euro European they ship their trashes to other countries and then they pay them for that that's crazy so like now I'm just explaining how it's different how we deal with trashes here and how they deal with trashes there she's mm -hmm. taking over my channel guys she's, really? ta she's <laughs> taking over my channel what's this yeah. <laughs> I'm supposed to be the star of my channel but today <laughs> yeah. today I'm not yeah. And I, I'm fine with that. Let, let her vibe. Let, let her do can that. Can you please? Can you? Guys, this one, two, three, four, five. Five things. One, two, three, four, five, yeah. Five things. 28 euro and 50 cents. Because mm -hmm. this is actually very cheap. Because, like, normally this is already like 12 euros, 50 euro. No, sorry, 12 euro, 50 cents, excuse me, in the shop. Well, here, how much is it, Uncle? This is 6.50. Six. I have to take another one. <laughs> 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 She's funny. Yeah. Take another one because that's actually really cheap. Because I normally pay for the smart, uh, the smaller one, like seven years or something. And I, and I only use it like for two weeks, especially in this dry season because my skin is very, you know, dry. dry yeah. yeah, so I have to use more. And then only this for like this two. For six uh, together? Twelve. Yes. Yeah. Thirteen euros, excuse me. Thirteen oh, yeah, euros. Okay. 
That's a buy. That's a sell. You better come here and buy this. So hey. you get it only hey. for where you can get it for uh, that price. By the ethos. No, no, I said, where do you come to get it for this price? Yeah, where? Yeah, right here. Right here. <laughs> right here. Right here. In Maastricht. That. That's why you come here. Afro Shop Giselle mm -hmm. Wato. I'm going to make a yeah, we'll make a picture, picture of, of the outside. Yeah. Can I like to pay uncle? Yeah, you have. You're coming here in Maastricht. Yeah, looking for no, some uh, some African products, mm -hmm. some hair, some foods. Mm -hmm. You should be here. Miss Giselle is not here right now, but mm -hmm. she'll be ready for you. Yeah, Miss Giselle is his wife. Mm. So, can you tell us a little bit how about how when your wife started the shop and why she did it? No, she's the boss. She was, but why did she do it and when and how that? The well, story of how she created it. Say again. Now, the story of how she created the store. How, how she? Yeah. How she? Yeah, and why she? Was did it, it easy for her to start the mm -hmm. shop here in Maastricht? Oh, it wasn't easy. It wasn't no. easy. Yeah, it's not too easy to it's start the easy. shop. Mm -hmm. Well, she's trying, but she's here almost mm -hmm. about. Uh, 17 years it's not easy 17 years yeah. i'm 19. that's crazy Before you, you were two years old <laughs> <laughs> yeah mm -hmm. especially for like and people that come from africa and stuff it's really like hard to you know to start and float you know and even to yeah. stay alive Just to stay alive right because like especially i mean your shop mm -hmm. yeah because especially like for us you know there are not a lot of africans you know Generally in neighborhoods like ours, you know, I don't mm. know in this neighborhood because it's the first time I'm actually really here. But like, you know, we can ask him. Are there a lot of Africans here? In yeah, in yeah. 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 Yes, it's a lot. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But also like people from, cause like you no, have we North have Africa. Af not only Africa from Congo, but yeah. for all around Africa. Mm. So yeah. We have people from Guinea. Mm -hmm from Zambia, mm -hmm. from Nigeria. South Africa, from Nigeria, from mm -hmm. everywhere. Mm -hmm. yeah. And what kind of African comes out the most? All of them. All of them? Yeah. Even the North Africans, the all South, of them. East, All of them. Mid because we eat the right? same food. Oh. They come about some stuff for yeah. food on food. Because all of us are African, we, mm -hmm. we eat the same food. Only cooking is different. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, I didn't know Everybody that. coming here. Oh, okay. All Africans, African. Ghana, like you. Uh, <laughs> yeah. That's beautiful. Yeah, yeah. Okay, Victoria, let's go because yeah, we have more to do today. Oh, yeah. Really? Yeah. yeah we have to go we come fish. here to buy fish by um, dolphin. Uh, by dolphin. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. So you have you never reached there, if you are going there. Yeah, we go in there. Yeah. Okay. But we wait a little bit because the fish will stay in the car. Mm -hmm. ah, okay. So we first uh, go and check here. Around, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. And this was the first shop we entered. Yeah, so. and it's also the African shop. Yes. So, yeah. So, so I'm happy to for you to be here. Yes. Mm -hmm. Thank you for your hospitality. It's not the first time. It's going to be more, 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 more every time. So I hope that you'll bring more customers for us. Yeah. We will. Yes. We will definitely will. Yeah. Yeah. So thank you. No problem. And I'm going to make a, a oh, yeah. picture of the outside here. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. Can I have these? Then I can order them for you. I don't know if I still have a card here. So that would be nice. For online? Yeah, for online. Because like that's really, you know, handy. Oh, is this the one we we use? Yum powder, add up. I don't know why they put potato starch and all these things. We are just looking for the pure, pure, yeah, pure nyam. <sighs> so you change it all. So that was the Afro shop. This is the name. Afro shop Giselle Wato. Exotique. So if you're ever in the neighborhood of Maastricht and you're looking for Afro shop, this is the place to go guys. This is the place to go. I think it's even the only Afro shop here in Maastricht. I hope it's not. I didn't ask. Well, Maastricht is pretty big, so it should have. Yeah, I think you're no, Venlo doesn't even have one. Yeah. We had, but it didn't survive. Oh, yeah, it didn't survive it, yeah. Yeah. 
Before you came to Venlo, we have one in the old street where I lived. Yeah, but it was already gone when you came. Oh, but then we had another one. Yeah, that one, um, the guy was married to a white lady, a German lady, and she opened the shop. But when they separate, the guy lost the shop. The big shop there by the by the police station there, and they they moved him to the where the library is. I call, there's now a nail studio there. They move him to there, and from there, yeah, the guy wasn't look also really serious. He was doing uh, business in the I don't want to call it African way, but you know how you do business in Africa. You can close your shop whenever you like. You can open it whenever you like, yeah. And he had, he brought that mentality to Venlo, yeah. and that didn't really work out. Mm. So eventually, he closed. He had to close the shop. Mm -hmm. I just saw a car that I want for my. Uh, um, excuse me. I just saw the car I saw that I wanted as my first car. The Mat the Matza. I'm saying that right. Matza. Mazda. The Matza. Mazda. The Mazda. <laughs> Mazda. Maz Mazda. 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 Yeah, I have like a problem with my pro oh, I can't even oh, pronounce right, that right. word too. <laughs> but pronunciation. Uh, pronunciation. Pronunciation. Whatever, whatever what it is. <laughs> but like. Well, you talk very fluent, but yeah. you have just uh, sometimes she's, she's saying things, especially in English, that we think like, did you just say that? Yeah. <laughs> Like I love calling um, the mac chicken. We call it here in English mac chicken, but I always call it, can I have a mac chicken? Um, uh, can I have a mac chicken? That's why I always ask my colleague because I work at the McDonald's. Can I have a mac chicken for me, please? A mac chicken. Yeah. <laughs> or like we call it here fries or friet, and I call it, can I have frites? Can I have more frites from you? Frites. Uh, yeah. That's I see like, a lot of people call fries chips. Yeah. In Kenya, everybody called chips. In Ghana, they call it chips. I think we only here in Europe we call it fries. Because of the English. It could be. Because of English and the colonization. Hey, my hand is freezing, man. Well, I don't really get Oof. why they call it ships, but I'll go look about that why they call it ships, because it doesn't for me like. Okay, we should do. We, sorry to cut you off. Yeah. We should do like a thumbnail here at this building. Carnival spirit. Do you see the flag? That's for carnival. Is it? Yeah, the, color, the three colors. Which it's the colors for Ghana. It only missed a black star. Yeah. <laughs> I love this building. Maybe it's very. I think this is the old um, Gemeente House. Um, how do you say that? Gemeente House? Government House. Yeah, Government House. Just say Government House. Yeah. But I like the the old style they have. I think we just too late for the market here. It looks like a vintage. Kind of market. You want to take a look? But this is very vintage. I love vintage. I love vintage. Vintage is so real. It's so It's so truly real. Like as this paint, like this painting will be nice. For who? This is look, do you see guys? This is what I love. This I will put this definitely in my house 100 percent This it's if it's uh, worth a million dollars, I would it doesn't I like matter. the elephant. But yeah, it doesn't even matter that it's not worth a million dollars. It's just like I like the calmness of this painting. It's so calm. I mean like imagine you're there just looking at it in real life. That would be like beautiful, right? Exactly. <laughs> you can look at it in your house. In this boo. Yeah. I like boo. Bullish and bearish. And in the stock market, uh -huh. in the stock market, um, bearish, sorry, sorry, bullish means that it's going up. Uh -huh. So that's why on the Wall Street they have one big, large building of a bull there. <laughs> uh oh, up. is that the reason? Yeah, bullish, always up, ah. never down. All right, <laughs> we learned something new here. It's nice. Oh, thank you. One of the books that I, one of the old books that I really want to see. Hitler's Pope. Hitler's Pope? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Hitler's Pope. Yeah. Hitler's Pope. So we like looking at books about the war. Oh, DNA complot of Corsica. 
Wow. Look, it's about Da Vinci. And I like, um, when I read books, I learned a lot of, oh sorry, I read a lot about Da Vinci's knowledge. And like about, not a lot though, because like it's a bit difficult to understand. But uh, like, I like reading about it. And it's just him, the nature what? The, how do you call it? How do you nature call it? laws. Nature laws, yes. It was a lot about that. And I really, really want to learn more about those. And it's in Dutch, so like, that's even better. <laughs> so it's called, I, I, you know what they call that? A smash. I'm gonna buy it. <laughs> I don't like Dutch books. I like to read in English. Yeah, obviously in English is... It's like they Ooh, change the language. Look at this. That's why I... Can I see? Can I see? Can I help us? That's why I love looking at vintage books. Because they're very real about or different. Like they don't... You know, you just find like the craziest books. Wait, wait, this is like about the anti... Americanism, anti zionism anti feminism uh, like this is like right now a lot of this is like something that you should be reading in the Palestine and Israel war. Uh, but I'm not sure what it's about obviously but <laughs> But it's like yeah I'm not sure what it's about. So you're gonna uh, buy that one? Yeah this one. Uh, yeah, but look. you don't have uh, cash. Oh, so cash. Can I open it? Oh, okay, good. I also have cash. Yeah, tegenwoordig heb je die. Um, Wisselen, you have those things. And those things are so handy. Like. Yeah, anyone can have yeah. it. You know, a tip to people who are have more income and are like begging on the street. What I advise you is that you like. You save, begging on yeah, the street? Yeah, you save all your money and then you like buy one of these. And then you go to people like I would. I say I would give you like 20 euros. <laughs> like if you come to me on a day that I got my money, I'd give you 20 euros. That's like a good investment. I give you 20 euros. So <laughs> maybe even a good day when I'm actually making money, 50 euros. That's smart, you know. That's, that's crazy. She say if you're a bagger, <laughs> save some money and buy you a pin, a pin machine. Yeah, and then bag like that. <laughs> I think a lot of people are gonna argue with you. Like, how did you get this? I think a lot of people are not going to be by. See this thing works yeah, through uh, the phone. Thank you. Thank you. So, right. let's... Oh man, my hand, hands are frozen. So I can learn a bit about the Like a fur coat. This is like real fur. Hmm? Oh, I mean, are you In your house. This? Yeah, I want this. Like this is gonna be. This is also nice. And then like flowers. Like this, but then we have flowers. I like this. Beautiful. One. I like the purple, blueish. Mm, and do you know that if you actually that some people try to like. They go to these markets and they find valuable things that they can actually sell for a lot of money. Yeah, but and like, some don't even yeah. know that it's valuable. Some don't even know. Like, I don't know. She looks like Amy Winehouse. Mm -hmm. Amy back in the day. Hello. Mm. Oh, this is nice. Yeah, this is that more, yeah. Oh, this is really nice. Calm, that doesn't sound like you. I I like calm. Eee. So I want to make a picture here by this building. Just make like a selfie. Beautiful. Mm -hmm. Where is it in? Which country is it from? I don't know. So, this looks like a mall, shopping mall. And like I said, we really came too late. Because now we have to go back to the car to get the fish. It's uh, going to 4.30, they close at 5. Ooh, so we have to like walk. Yeah, so yeah. we're going back and then we come back to the centrum. Maybe we should go and eat somewhere. Yeah, I'm into eating like... Fancy place. Mm -hmm. Bye, you know, I don't want to get McDonald's or just something nice. Mm -hmm. 
But I'm like a picky eater, so if I don't know something, and I won't eat it. So like, it's hard for me to like, I don't like going to places I don't know, because if I don't like the food, I won't eat anything. So like McDonald's is always a safe space, because McDonald's is everywhere the same in the Netherlands. And uh, this is true what you say, she's very picky. We went to, with, uh, with her brother and uh, the three small ones, we went to Eindhoven. <laughs> And it was a fish place, and me and my man used to come there always. But she and Emmanuel were so picky, they were complaining the whole time. They eat, but they were complaining the whole time, like, yeah, this and all that. <laughs> you were. Yeah, if, I, but if something, like, if I'm eating, if I'm paying for food, it has to be good, you know? I'm not paying there to, like, eat food that's not in my taste. Well, you used, you, you didn't, you used to be different. You used to eat everything. Yeah, but I don't like the taste of my tongue anymore. So what kind of food would you like to eat? Sushi. I, mean sushi. I feel for Italian food, like... I feel for Italian food today. But Italian food is like so cheesy, I don't, you know... Oh my god, did that just came from your mouth? Oh, look at those shoes. Did that just go... Yeah. This girl is addicted to cheese, huh? And she's saying, yeah, it's too cheesy. Oh, look that. <laughs> That's look crazy. That. I also have the one of those. I also what? have one of those. Those are those like, what? So one of those. The boxes. Yeah, the boxes. I have one of those. Oh yeah, exactly that one. Yeah, it's like so cute. Under the table there. Yeah. This is real fur. Oh, yeah. well, I don't really like. But real they, fur. they are cheap. Because they're second hand. Twenty five like euro, yeah, but still, real fur is still expensive. Yeah. Hey, they have. Uh, I will buy this. If they have a pen. No, no, no. Hey, look at this. What, what the hell is this? Is this a shoe? Yeah. <laughs> Crazy. <I love> <laughs> uh, I don't have. I forgot my my. Forgot my money in the car, so. Probably they don't have this pin thing. So we came from there. So I would like to come back. Look there, Hawaiian Poke Bowl. But like, I'm alright with eating Italian food. Obviously, if you want to eat Italian food. For me, it's no problem. I just, I said, I feel for something different. What does ATM stands for? Uh. Money? Automatic money. Uh, automatic. Nee, automatic. A. The emphasis for machine. Yeah, but it starts with A. Yeah. Automatic. Automatic, yeah. Money. 80. Uh, automatic. <laughs> T. Money. What? It's like, <laughs> I was like in my room and I was like, huh? What's ATM stands for? That's my ATM. So, yeah. ATM, sorry. What does ATM stands for? Well, suddenly it was in my brain. And I was like, well, I'm not going to research it. I want to know. It just by like my memory. Like I've had logic. It yeah, yeah, I don't, I've had it I, I don't know. So I don't know. I don't know what the T is for. Mm -hmm. Transport? No. It could be transportation because you're like transportation the money. Yeah. money Automatic transport, transport money. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> what do you guys think it stands for? Yeah. Are we searching? There, we there will be one job. smarty pants who knows it. Yeah. I know there's a lot of smart people in my, uh, intelligent people in my, uh, in one my of group. Knows. Part of your friends. Please. Yeah, f part of my subscribers. Yeah. Or part of your family. And I'm, I'm getting to know my subscribers. Mm -hmm. So, and it's a nice group of people. And I hope it will grow. It will only grow more bigger, more better. Well, I actually now do have a question for you. Yeah. I'm on, um, we're walking with you right now, and I know people look at you yeah. that you're recording. How do you deal with that feeling? Uh, I used to feel uncomfortable. You know, mm -hmm. when I'm alone in the street and talking to the camera, mm -hmm. I, I still feel uncomfortable. Yeah, but now is that you with me? I'm talking to someone. I don't really care mm -hmm. what other people think. Mm -hmm. That's but I'm not yet at the point that I feel free enough yeah. to walk to somebody and just like uh, like Maro I used to do he just walked to someone in the street mm -hmm. 
and he just asks questions. I'm not comfortable enough to do that. Yeah, I understand. But I can walk in the shop and ask people. But Mama has like a large following, right? So like, yeah. people would want to like be on his channel more. Yeah, but he, the, in his old videos, he already do that. Oh, really? That's really great. In his old videos. He, were, he came to the Netherlands once. Really? Yeah, and he went to Amsterdam. And he, there were two, two young boys, I think they were like 15 or 14, and they were longer than two meters Ooh. and he said he just walked up to the guys and he asked like yeah can i uh can you stand up and show the people how tall the people in the netherlands yeah. are and that kind of thing <laughs> That's really he's cool. very free to do that now i'm not yeah. there yet yeah. but like yeah i understand yeah i'm not there yet but, but you will be in time obviously yeah, yeah, i should yeah, subscribe yeah. it takes it takes time I didn't even imagine myself being in a video uh, two months ago. Mm -hmm. I mean, like, we have been cooking water for years, right? No, not thousands of years, but it still takes long. It still takes time to cook water. Yeah. You get what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even though we've been cooking water for like thousands of years, it still takes a lot of time. To yeah, but for, for, for how time. many years I've been saying I'm, I want to do YouTube, I want to do this, I want to do for how many years? And now I finally, it just clicked now. Mm -hmm. That's why I'm happy I went to Kenya. Mm -hmm. Kenya really changed my yeah, and perspective. Did you, and did you know that like, when she was going to Kenya, I was like a bit like, mm, what are you going to do there? Like, yeah. like, you can get subscribers here in the Netherlands. You don't have to go all the way to Kenya. Mm -hmm. But like, as she went and I was watching the videos, I really saw that it was really something she had to do. Yes. Like she really enjoyed. And this these subscribers I have they are international. Huh? Yeah, that's really beautiful too. They are Africa, USA, mm -hmm. England, even Germans. Mm -hmm. I have some Germans. Dutch, Suriname. Mm -hmm. Oh what kind of Porsche is that? I've never seen that one before. <laughs> this girl in cars. <laughs> I don't like this one. What kind of abomination is that? Ab <laughs> Abom Very disgusting Porsche. <laughs> I cannot zoom in, but this is the Porsche she's talking about. I think like they had it, you know, I think it's like a Kian. It's electric. A Kian, yeah. And then like they changed a few things what they didn't like about the car. See, it's an electric car. And then car. by doing that, they ruined the whole car. Mm -hmm. Now it looks like every other car. What I, one thing I really like about Porsche is the individual. The individually, the <laughs> individuality, the individuality. <laughs> they like they go heavy on that. That's like one of their since the um, I think it was in 1931 that mm. he started, or 33, one of those two that he started Porsche. Uh. It was before the Great War, uh -huh. before the Second World War, he started. And like one of the things was individuality. You know, individualism. I don't Individualism. Yeah, all those things was it. And I really found my find myself in those, you know, uh. in that. So that's why I really want a Porsche. Okay. Yeah. And uh, I remember, I remember one of the posts that was like written like something like, "You may not be an individual in life, but on the street you are one." Uh -huh. And that's like, that was so beautiful when I read that. I was like, hell yeah, I'm gonna buy one. <laughs> hell yeah. We should cross uh, here. Like 100% now. Now that I've said that, I'm gonna buy one. So uh, I have a question. Huh? How is it for you now to be in this time? Uh, to be like a student in this time? Because I, I remember my own student time. It was so different from from now yeah. you people learn different things you yeah well we don't have the uniform thing going on no, here but we don't actually I like the uniform thing kind of it was like girly poppy mm -hmm. and I could like change it to my style I wouldn't mind it. oh that what they do in England yeah that that's so cute <laughs> but well, how do you experience being a student um, well, I have exam week now, not this week, next week, mm. and um, I've been studying for a while now. Mm -hmm. And yeah. But you like studying, yeah? No, I don't. It's 
Yeah. You don't? Yeah, I don't. You don't like no. studying? No. But I do enjoy getting smarter. But I don't enjoy studying. Okay. Like, the way that they have it here, the system, it doesn't really work for me. Uh, why I like studying is like, when I have something free to do, I can watch like a documentary. Like, cause that's like what I love doing. Yeah. Like, if they could put it, what they're preaching in the schools and make it like a documentary or like a movie that I can watch, then it would be so fun. But mm -hmm. now I, I don't really like reading that much. Even though I just bought a book, I do have to read because there's no substitute. I don't do anything else. Mm -hmm. So I read and watch videos. Yeah. So yeah, that okay. is it. So I, if you so think that I enjoy study, I do not. I really don't. Yeah, it's, to me it's like you, not like you enjoy it, but... Yeah, yeah but it's because I have to do it. Yeah. So I, like, I'm, yeah, well, you know, I'm just, I'm kind of like, okay, I don't have any choice, so I better just do it. Let's get it over. Well, you are very driven. With school and everything, you're driven. Right. You don't, I, I never have to tell uh, Victoria, you have to do your homework. She's just doing it by herself. I, I, I don't even have to look at that. There was a time that I didn't used to be like that. Yeah, there was. Right. <laughs> you almost witnessed a breakdown. Crazy. <laughs> it's so slippery it's here, so man. It's so slippery, right. <sighs> okay, so we got back to the car. Yeah. And uh, we're going to take you to uh, fish, fish, fish handle, fish, uh, fish factory. <laughs> The, the, the dolphin. Like, uh -huh. yeah. But is it like the water? I was you never been there, yeah? No, I haven't been there. And it's already freezing outside, so let's see how freezing it is there. Mm -hmm. <sighs> oh, imagine walking down the summer. It would be really nice. That would be good. Oh, I love that. That's what I used to walk at the Lido. It's like a store in the, uh, here in the Netherlands. And like in the yeah, court? but it's from the Germans. Yeah, it's it's a German, German shop. Yeah, German. Just like Aldi. Mm -hmm. But like in the summer, it would be so nice to walk there. Uh -huh. oh, and how I loved it. Okay, in the summer, it is everywhere nice to walk. Oh, okay. Especially really cool. in the cafes. I enjoy the summertime the most. Uh -huh. I need to get my ticket out of the car. I'm going to pay for the parking. Let's see how much it is. Four fifty. Hmm, that's okay. Uh, okay, I'm gonna use my phone to pay. Voila. That's how simple it goes. And then I can take my card. It didn't pay. Oh. Okay. I need to approve it. That's it, guys. It's that simple. So we have arrived to the Dauphin. This is where I buy my fish every two, three months. Just come here. Oh, I'm not. I'm gonna get a headache of the smell. Yeah, it doesn't smell very nice here, but. Oh, yeah, see this is where we get African product or they don't have yam. I find it so funny because like this is a Hello. 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 It's like a Dutch business but they changed it because the African yeah. They changed it to the target out here. Mm -hmm. So you can buy here your products. Uh, you can buy fish. Normally we have yams here, but I don't see them. You can get rice. Hello. Hello. Um, we, we want to buy fish. Fish. Can you can you film her? Oh, he doesn't want to be on the camera. Um, I need horse makrel. Horse 
Five and sixty. Five and sixty. went up. The price went up. Yeah, yeah. Um, five and sixty. What is? I remember when it was forty-five. And um, uh, Melusa. And okay. Do one Melusa, one uh, horse mackerel. Twenty kilo and um, horse mackerel. Yeah. Horse mackerel or mackerel. Horse mackerel. Horse mackerel. I have a very close effect. Twenty kilo. Yeah. You grow to the medium. Medium. And um. And the Melusa. Yeah. And you have. Uh, I'm filming myself. And do you have? Uh, what do you call it? Zebras. The royal. No, the white one. The what? No zebras. The on the roof. Yeah, or oh, mat. The zebras come to me. Doesn't want to put his face on the camera, so I respect that. <sighs> what do you think of this place? Hmm? Okay, then those two. If you have some some material, or some material. You have also Melusa 20 kilo. Melusa 20 kilo costs 90 euro. Ik heb het 10 kilo kost 45. Dat is 10 kilo. Zo, alleen twee kartonnen. Eén Melusa en de Osma Kree. Heb je niet aan je dingen? Eh, which other fish do you have? Ja, maar je moet weten wat je eet, hè? Ja. Tilapia. Ja, we don't. Only those two. Only those two. Oké. I used to buy a zebra. Teen. Yeah, I used to buy red snapper, but I noticed people really don't really like it. You don't really like it now. Mm, I mean, like in the summertime, I like it like for once in like two months, then it's like nice. But other than that, no. Yeah. But like they do have shrimp there. And you have like um, octopus? Octopus, yeah. Yeah, I have octopus here too. I'm gonna get some red oil. What do you think of this place? I mean, it looks like... Why is this car here? <laughs> is this one? I buy three. Huh? There's all these things I still have at home. I love seeing that people succeed. That's what my heart out. I love that. But why you park it in the shop? Oh. Some bitter leaf. Some shrimp. So this is the melusa? This is melusa, I can see some of it. Hello. 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 Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have no seabars. Yes, yeah. I don't buy any. Yeah. I love oh, meat actually. Better leaf, but they they take we take we need. Yeah, because I remember one time my mom accidentally bought the other one and then she cooked it and then we like found out that it was totally different. Oh. Uh, yeah. The meat. <laughs> yeah, you, when you like oh, bought yeah, yeah. It didn't taste nice. It didn't taste nice. It's very so you need to be careful with what you're but buying. Yeah, better leaf. Oh. Yeah. 
die, 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 die willen komen at the right moment. Je moet ook kijken wat je filmt, hè. Oh, hij wil niet te zeggen. Eh, drie? It's like uh, we came at the wrong moment. Everything is finished. Why are you filming the ground? <laughs> I'm filming how narrow I have to walk there. You know, the narrowness of that place. So, I'm right now here. She's by next door. I'm looking at the shrimp. So tasty. And what we what we're buying, the fish. And here's my mother. We don't have anything here. Oh, we came out the wrong time. Yeah. Imagine maybe, maybe it's a good uh, thing that we can come back. Yeah, we can come we back. We can really buy things. Explore Maastricht better also. Mm -hmm. I was thinking about like the shrimp. Go and buy the shrimp. Oh yeah, you want to buy shrimp? You want, because uh, my mom said she wanted to buy peanut. She wanted to make a uh, peanut stew. Oh, peanut soup. Yeah, now she Maybe has like you use yeah. This one, yeah. I think that would like. How much is it? I don't know. So three times for ten euros. Where do you see that? Yeah. Oh, three yeah. times for ten euros. If that you is not gonna eat all of this bread. Wait, you should look at the date, cause like. I don't think hair, but like, it's important. 13, 12, end of the year. Okay, end of the year, there we can eat it. And I have like shrimp, different kind of shrimp, how I love shrimp. Oh, they also have crab. I actually want to, oh, oh, we're a You're not really a good filmer. <laughs> <laughs> You're a terrible filmer. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You you are more to be in the film. Yeah, I'm so <laughs> She's just <laughs> filming <laughs> rubbish. <laughs> but these batteries go finish fast, man. Yeah. It's like not even one hour. I like the taste of shrimp so much. We can buy one bag. You can take one. But I don't know. Yeah, I want to know the price because maybe in in Venlo is cheaper. Yeah, I like the food. Yeah, thank you. So this and this. Um, can I do the pipe of the shrimp? Huh? The pipe is back there. Where's the shrimp? Separate from this one. We need it downstairs. We need to see this. So cold here. Extra cold. Huh? Yeah, take Pakma. Look. It's a big one. Mm. You can pick two. This is cheap. Ten euro. You pay like 16 euro in Vando. How are you living with living hefty things? Heavy things. This is not heavy. Yeah, but I don't like this. <laughs> Oh. So we pay 150 for all this. Price went up. The price yeah. really went up. I used to buy 45 for the big ones and like 20 for the small ones. Does that fit with this twisty? Should I remove that? Just put it on top. Yeah. I don't want it to touch the. Oh yeah, because then the smell of fish stays inside. Can you hold this? We don't like fishy smell. So we do like fishy smell when it's fried. Yeah. We are filming. <laughs> Sorry guys, Victoria is not the best. No, I'm not lady. the best filmer. I only like know how to film myself, and that's it. Yeah. That's it, like. That's where that ends. Well, I will teach you some skills. Mm -hmm. So, that's it. Let's 
get out of here. It's too cold. My arms are not meant for like heavy things, so I do not carry heavy things. So, that was it guys, that was the fish part, oh, I'm freezing, it's so cold, can you imagine to work there with this cold, mm -hmm. the whole day you are in the cold, well that was the, the fish buying part, so um, if you are interested, if you live in the neighborhood of Maastricht and even if you are in the neighborhood you can buy any type of fish here they have a lot of type but yeah my children and my family doesn't really like all kinds so I only bought this two the zebras they don't have unfortunately that one is the best as long as it's fresh but yeah they don't have so soon we will come back here and get that for now I want to say thank you for watching my video thank you for subscribing if you like the video please hit the thumbs up give an extra shout out to victoria victoria has been the star of my show today <laughs> well i'm supposed to be the star but I, I'll, I'll give it to you you you're doing good mm -hmm. why you don't open a youtube channel for yourself because um i don't have the time i think i don't have the time well i do have the time but i don't want to make that time up because i feel like i could use that time more for my own like my own things that are more important to me because i really want to go the economic side and like i mean i could do it with youtube but like it's for me like easier to just do it on my own pace just on my own time sometimes i'm not gonna do it sometimes i'm gonna do it and i don't want anything to like well but you don't have to be like me you're posting every day you can do it just like once in a your while. limit is just once in a week yeah but still then like it just you know and if, especially if i like I don't want to get famous with YouTube. That's the thing too. Like, imagine if I get famous. My like, how I've always seen my life in front of my eyes. Because like, I always plan out my steps. And as a younger child, I always wanted to be famous as an um, economist. Like, just having great, making great theories from economy mm -hmm. about the market, about stuff. That's who I want to be. You know, I can also do that with a YouTube channel. But like, I don't have any. You know. But, but, but uh, I heard through the grapevine that you already have a channel. Yeah, I do have a channel, but like... So give yourself a shout out and in case uh, people want to subscribe to you. I have to look it up. Because <laughs> I don't know it out of my head. Did you make it by yourself? Yeah, but like it's, it's not even like, it's not even... It's more like just a thing I made. Did you have? Did you make some videos? No, I didn't. I don't think I'll put out any video, guys. So if you want to, if you want to see more of me, you just have to dream more about me. <laughs> Sorry. Well, let's show your channel. Um, it's like Victoria Training One O One, because like. Okay, sure, it should. Victoria Training. Oh no, you can't see it, but I will yeah. put it in the... Because like, I want to be a trader, you know, and trading consumes already like a lot of time. And I also have school, work, my social life. My social life is really important. It's really important. I need to make enough time to plan out my social life. So how can I then also do the YouTube and stuff? And also the trading and economics. Like the knowledge that I'm like, you know, it's like you have to sit down to fully understand the knowledge you know you cannot just i cannot be like listening to something and then be cooking because it's like for me it's heavy load so you know you have to calm down like in the classroom in the classroom you cannot be cooking and uh, be in the classroom it's not gonna work because it's mm -hmm. knowledge is like quite a bit hard to understand so like i need those like one or two hours a day where i can just process that information mm -hmm. all right yeah. That's it for me. So, if you want to follow her, it's Victoria Trading 101. Yeah, Victoria Trading 101. Yeah. Uh, I will put it in the description also. Yeah, but if you want to see more of me, you have to take a screenshot or a picture and just like put it as your background and stuff. Put it as your background? Did you just say that? 
Maybe <laughs> be careful what you wish for. <laughs> so guys, thank you very much. <laughs> thank you very much for watching our video. I hope you liked it. And um, yeah, we are still going to have some fun here. Maybe you will see it in, a, in another video. This will be like a cycle of a few, few videos. So I hope you enjoyed it and enjoy it. Bye guys. Bye, Bye my friends. Ciao.